We're recommending a greater reliance on peer supports because of some of the unintended consequences of relying so uh, heavily on adult delivered support. We're learning that students academic engagement, that their class participation and even their social connections in the class might actually be hindered when students re receive all of their support from an educational assistant. One of the tendencies in classrooms is that the teacher of that classroom tends to defer responsibility to that educational assistant for the learning of the student with significant disabilities. We also are finding that students tend to have fewer interactions with their classmates when they're receiving support from an individually assigned adult. So when there's always an educational assistant sitting next to a student, those stu other classmates might be reluctant to start up a conversation if they feel like they're kind of being listened to by that adult. We're trying to break some of that heavy reliance on that adult and getting students to turn to others in that environment, uh, classmates, the classroom teacher, uh, school counselors, others, rather than always first turning to that educational assistant. Engaging peers in providing some of those supports is a real promising alternative to that exclusive reliance on adult support. Simply pairing two students up and having them sit together and work together uh, doesn't ensure that those that peer will feel confident and comfortable in their roles. And if they're not provided that initial orientation and some direction on the kinds of supports they should and shouldn't provide, and given in some instruction on how to most effectively provide those supports, well then sometimes that support doesn't really work out and the students might uh, fall behind in their own classwork if they're not sure how to navigate balancing their work and the support of another student. So those initial orientation sessions become so important so that students are really well prepared to assume those roles well. You can't simply pair students up and hope that those social and academic benefits come. You really have to be thoughtful about uh, in your planning of how you connect those students, about the supports you provide to them as they work together, and then you also want to make sure that you're very thoughtful about reflecting on the kinds of outcomes students are having so that you can make adjustments if things aren't going as planned.